After the WARF model is run, the output is run through the Unified Post Processor, or UPP, to interpolate model data output into new vertical coordinates, for example, to pressure levels, and also to compute a number of diagnostic variables that are then output in GRIB2 format. We'll expand our Docker procedures to take a look at this Docker run command. For this step, Docker uses the DT Center UPP container to run the run UPP script while pointing to the local scripts directory as well as to the wharf out forecast files that were generated in the previous step located in the wharf PRD output directory. The output from the UPP program comes in GRIB2 format and is placed in the post PRD output directory. So let's copy and paste this command into our AWS terminal window and press enter. Again, you can use the tail utility to examine the progress of the UPP program in another terminal window. In this case, the log files are called unipost.out. But this program runs relatively quickly for this case, and yes, it looks like it has already completed. So let's move into the post PRD output directory and take a look at what we have. For the UPP program, the output files we're looking for begin with wharf PRS, and there should be one file for each of the forecast hours. So now that the post processing step is complete, you are ready to move on to creating graphics.